So we have looked at this algorithm A star and we have seen one or two of its variations which are space saving variations. So let us run this on our software and compare it with how best first works essentially. So best first if you remember uh, looks only at the heuristic distance and therefore it is more focused towards the goal. Whereas A star uses two values g of n plus h of n where g of n is a look back kind of a function and it ends up as we will see exploring more of the space. So let us start with the uh, uh, best first search and let us choose a graph. Let us have this as a start node and let us say somewhere here as a goal node and so if you remember our algorithm you can step through this algorithm so the black nodes are the nodes on the closed the blue nodes are the nodes on the open and this kind of shows how best first search is as you can see heading towards the goal node so we can also run the whole thing to see, see it as an animation and we can change the speed as well. So this is what best first search has done as you can see it is gone pretty straight towards the goal and so let us now try the A star algorithm on this same problem and so I will just run it directly and you can see that it explores a little bit more than the best first search. It is looking left and right because it is trying to stay also close to the start node which best first is not bothered about because A star knows that the total cost of a solution is the sum of g of n plus h of n. So, it is trying to minimize that sum essentially. Then we saw that uh, there are some space saving versions of A star in particular uh, we saw IDA star. So, let us see uh, run IDA star over the same problem. Now, if you remember what IDA star does is that it iteratively deepens the search essentially. So, it does a sequence of depth first searches uh, which means that it needs uh, um, linear space for open. So, this is how uh, as you can see it is doing repeated searches and one of the problems with this algorithm and also the next algorithm that we will see which is recursive best first search is that there is a lot of repetitive work uh, which can sometimes be very bad and we can call it like thrashing in the sense that you know it just keeps doing the same things again and again essentially. So let us speed this up a little bit but we will see that it will perform the same as uh, uh, a star in terms of the correctness of the solution. So, it will find the same path. Uh, so, here we are essentially. So, this is a third algorithm that we wanted to compare and the last one is recursive best first search. So, remember the recursive best first search is a little bit like uh, uh, hill climbing with backtracking. And this also, this value k is the value that we use in W A star. So, we will give it 1 because we are comparing it with A star. And okay, so there seems to be some issue here. So let us see this is what best first search did, this is what A star did, it, as you can see it explored more of the space than best first search. IDA star also explored the same space as A star but it did that through a series of repeated searches and we had some issue with best first search. So let us try again with another problem. So let us start with best first search as before. 
let us choose uh, graph like this. So, let us now choose this as a start node and as you can see the start node I have chosen is not directly linked towards a goal that we are interested in, but let us see how So, this is best first. So, as you see it had to go off in the wrong direction to start with that is because there was no direct path, but it did find the path. So, it is complete. If we had run hill climbing on this same algorithm, uh, you can see that it would have got stuck at the very beginning. So, let us run hill climbing here and you can see that it is not making a move at all essentially. That is because uh, in the direction of the goal there is nothing there. But let us try uh, our A star algorithm. So, it also starts off by going off in the wrong direction in some sense, but it explores more of the space and you can see that it has found a different path from what best first had found. We will compare it uh, in a moment. The other algorithm that we saw was iterative deepening A star. So, let us run that on this and as you can see it is doing a lot of searches. So, when we see this yellow node that means that it is about to start a new search and it obviously repeats what it did earlier and let us speed it up because it takes otherwise a lot of time and that is one of the disadvantages of IDA stuff is that the trade off with time is not very good that the amount of time it takes is much larger. But as you can see here it uh, found the same uh, path as A star actually. So, let us give another try for this recursive best first search and see if that works. Okay, so, this time it is working and you can see that uh, it is basically doing again a sequence of searches. So, it is it is behaving a little bit like hill climbing and except for the fact that it can roll back the search and start all over again. So, it is not as if it is starting from scratch every time, but whenever the current node does not have the best nodes as the neighbor, it kind of rolls back and starts again. So, let us speed it up and we will see that recursive was best first search also eventually explores almost the same space as uh, A star and eventually found the path in this case of length 27. So, let us just compare the searches. So, this was recursive best first search. Uh, black nodes are the ones which are enclosed eventually. This is IDA star whose search space is closer to the A star search. So, there must have been some issue with the RBFS implementation. The A star search and the IDA star searches are the same as you can see. The same nodes have been explored and the same path has been found. Hill climbing just did, did not even start and best first search found a different path essentially. So, let us take uh, one last uh, test. We will start with uh, another graph and we will start with uh, let us say hill climbing this time. We choose a sparse graph. So, we choose a nodes where hill climbing will make at least some progress. So, let us say this is a start node and let us say this is the goal node. So, hill climbing will make some progress, but let us see if it find the path to the goal. It did not as you can see it came a node which appeared closest to the goal and then it got stuck there. For the same 
problem. We will see that uh, best first search will indeed find a uh, path to the goal and it does it very quickly. So, you can see that at the point where hill climbing had got stuck, best first actually went backwards a little bit in the sense that it went away from the goal a little bit and then eventually found an alternate path to the goal. And the reason for that is that it is a global search algorithm as, comp as opposed to hill climbing which is a local search algorithm. So, again let us compare A star on the same problem. Does it find the same path or does it find a different path? In this it looks like it is going to find the same path and that is because the heuristic function is guiding it quite well. So, if you let us try the idea star again. Okay. So, you can see it is doing a repeated iterative deepening searches. Every time it overrides on the yellow, it is starting a new search from the start node essentially. But you can see it is making the same progress as uh, what A star was doing and it will eventually find the same path as A star. Let me speed it up a bit. I think so. There we are. Is it the same path? Uh, Let us compare. This is idea star. This was A star. They found different paths. So, we need to figure out whether there was an error in one of the algorithms. So, these algorithms were developed by students in my class at some point. So, maybe we have not vetted them carefully enough, but this is a general idea of uh, showing that the hill climbing gets stuck at this place, uh, best first finds a path, it turns out that A star finds the same path and for some reason ID star finds a different path. <laughs>